One of the first things I do when I arrive is put on this headset. Each member has one and by pressing the big button I just showed, you are able to talk to everyone. After this, I go into the store and I go through our opening checklist. One thing that I do every day is refill our essential oil diffusers, but every time I filmed myself doing this, the footage would delete. So instead I am showing a clip of myself replacing our security camera batteries, which I do whenever the old ones are dead. I always try and make sure that I accomplish this before we open. The last thing I do before we open is roll our sales racks outside. These racks typically hold our three tag colors that are on sale at 60, 40, and 20% off. This video is from a few weeks ago, so now instead of a table for shoes, we have a rack. Once we have opened, I head upstairs to work on my checklist and my other tasks that I have for the day. This loft space is also used as our photography studio. This is where I take pictures for our website and social media. Here is also where I spend most of my days tagging products online and staging new outfits for flat lays. We also hold the items that are photographed in this space until they have been included in a social media post and are ready to go back out on the sales floor. Here is a video of me photographing some clothes, which are our newest website item. Once they are uploaded to our website, I can then link them into social media posts. When you click on this tag, it will send you straight to our website where you can then purchase the item you wish. Another one of my tasks is cutting down our website stickers to fit on our tags. This marks the item to let customers know that the products are also available to be purchased online. I add these stickers on once I have photographed, edited, and uploaded the product's pictures onto shop article. Each item has a different number of angles the product must be shown in. For example, one shoe is taken and first photographed from the side then diagonally. After that, we take both shoes and face them forward towards the camera, then backwards so that you are able to see the back of the shoe, and then diagonally from one another. Lastly, we take a picture of the bottom of the shoe to show the condition. Depending on the shoe, you may have to do additional photos of close-up details, but for this shoe, I did not have to. If an item is not already tagged, I will attach it to the bottom of the right shoe, followed by size stickers in visible places on either one of the shoes, and then a website sticker next to the tag. Sometimes my mentor will give me random projects to complete. On multiple occasions, I have been given things to build. Previously, I have built a cart that we now use for tagging. This time, I was given a ring light. This is used so that we can help better enhance our photos that are going on our website and social media. I read the instructions and connected each piece carefully and then I plugged it in to test out the light. While I was testing the light, I found that you can change both the brightness and color. At this point in my day, there has been at least one post on social media, so I will go into Facebook on the computer to tag products from our website. You can do this from your phone for Instagram, but not for Facebook. My favorite task to complete at my internship is creating a flat lay. I first pick items that have been put on the website and pull any additional pieces from the sales floor to complete an outfit. Then I lay them out on our white background and take the pictures. After this, I edit the picture and start putting together my post. I make sure that I come up with a caption that is interactive and thematic. I also include any items that cannot be tagged to give more information on these as well. Then, depending on the time, I will either instantly post or I will save the draft to be posted when needed. I have a folder on my Instagram account where I save all the posts that I have created for our social media pages. These vary from flat lays to photographing fellow team members holding certain merchandise. Here, I also have a few posts saved where I was the model. I really enjoy working with the social media pages and getting to create some fun posts. At this point in my day, I have completed my checklist and head home.